Hey guys, welcome back, I'm Jay. In this episode, we're gonna look at AWS Cloud HSM. HSM stands for Hardware Security Module. HSM is a computing device that processes cryptographic operations and provides secure storage for cryptographic keys. AWS Cloud HSM is a cloud-based HSM that enables you to easily generate and use your own encryption keys in AWS. Cloud HSM is a fully managed service that automates administrative tasks, such as hardware provisioning, software patching, and backups. Cloud HSM enables you to generate and use your encryption keys on a FIPS 142 Level 3 validated hardware. Cloud HSM protects your keys with exclusive, single-tenant access to tamper-resistant HSM instances in your own VPC. Cloud HSM helps you build secure workloads and helps you demonstrate compliance with security, privacy and anti-tamper regulations, such as HIPAA, FedRAMP and PCI. Cloud HSM offers you the flexibility to integrate with your applications using industry standard APIs, such as Java Cryptography Extensions or JCE, PKCS number 11, and Microsoft Crypto NG or CNG libraries. With AWS Cloud HSM, you can perform a variety of cryptographic tasks. You can generate, store, import and export, and manage cryptographic keys, including symmetric keys and asymmetric key pairs. You can use symmetric and asymmetric algorithms to encrypt and decrypt data. You can use cryptographic hash functions to compute message digests and hash-based message authentication codes. You can cryptographically sign data, including code signing and verify signatures. You can generate cryptographically secure random data. Cloud HSM provides hardware security modules in a cluster. A cluster is a collection of individual HSMs that Cloud HSM keeps in sync. You can place HSMs in different availability zones in an AWS region. Additional HSMs provides higher performance in a cluster. Spreading clusters across availability zones provides redundancy and high availability. AWS recommends that you have a minimum of two HSMs in each cluster, with each HSM in different availability zones within an AWS region. When you create an HSM, Cloud HSM puts an Elastic Network Interface or ENI in the specified subnet in your AWS account. HSM ENI is the interface for interacting with the HSM. HSM resides in a separate VPC in an AWS account that is owned by Cloud HSM. HSM and the corresponding ENI are in the same availability zone. To interact with HSMs in a cluster, you need to install the client software on EC2 instances. The client instances reside in the same VPC as HSM ENIs. Each client instance communicates with the individual HSM in the Cloud HSM cluster through the ENI. When you create a cluster with more than one HSM, you automatically get load balancing between your HSMs. Cloud HSM client distributes operations across all HSMs in the cluster. In a Cloud HSM cluster, Cloud HSM keeps the keys on the individual HSMs in sync. You don't need to do anything to synchronize the keys on your HSMs. When you add a new HSM to a cluster, Cloud HSM makes a backup of all keys, users, and policies on an existing HSM. It then restores that backup onto the new HSM. Cloud HSM stores the backups in a service-controlled S3 bucket, in the same AWS region as your cluster. You can use Cloud HSM to offload SSL or TLS processing for your web servers. SSL or TLS is used to confirm the identity of web servers and establish secure HTTPS connections over the internet. Using Cloud HSM for this processing reduces the burden on your web server and provides extra security by storing your web server's private key in Cloud HSM. In a public key infrastructure, a certificate authority or CA is a trusted entity that issues digital certificates. These digital certificates are used to identify a person or organization. You can use Cloud HSM to store your private keys and sign certificate requests, so that you can securely act as an issuing CA to issue certificates for your organization. You can use Cloud HSM to store the Transparent Data Encryption or TDE Master Encryption Key, if you are running your own Oracle database servers on EC2. With TDE, supported database servers can encrypt data before storing it on disk. You can configure AWS KMS to use your Cloud HSM cluster as a custom key store. KMS Custom Key Store provides single-tenant HSMs under your control, with the ease of use and integration of AWS KMS. In this episode, we've learned AWS Cloud HSM. 
Cloud HSM is a cloud-based hardware security module or HSM that enables you to easily generate and use your own encryption keys in AWS Cloud. Cloud HSM enables you to generate and use your encryption keys on a FIPS 142 Level 3 validated hardware. Cloud HSM protects your keys with exclusive, single-tenant access to tamper-resistant HSM instances in your own VPC. Cloud HSM helps you build secure workloads and helps you demonstrate compliance with security, privacy and anti-tamper regulations, such as HIPAA, FedRAMP and PCI. Cloud HSM provides hardware security modules in a cluster. A cluster is a collection of individual HSMs that Cloud HSM keeps in sync. AWS recommends that you have a minimum of two HSMs in each cluster, with each HSM in different availability zones within an AWS region. When you create a cluster with more than one HSM, you automatically get load balancing between your HSMs. Cloud HSM Client distributes operations across all HSMs in the cluster. Cloud HSM automatically stores the backup in an S3 bucket in the same AWS region as your cluster. Okay, that's all for AWS Cloud HSM. Thanks for watching and see you in the next episode. Hope you've enjoyed watching this episode. If you like the video, please help us and hit the like button. If you want to watch more tutorials, please subscribe to the Cloudemy TV channel. Make sure to turn on the notification and stay tuned. At Cloudemy, we're passionate about cloud and AI technology. Please share your feedback and thoughts in the comments below. Feel free to let us know what topics you'd like to watch. Happy watching and happy learning!